All right, what's up everybody? We're here in Austin, Texas at our sick Airbnb. But uh, I have the old Paul Macbeth bag here, the A-Series. But then today I got the new Paul Macbeth bag that is going to be released very soon. I'm gonna be taking stuff from this bag and seeing how it fits into the new Paul bag. So let's get into it. Just looking at the bag, some things that I was told that's different. The main compartment flap, if you can see, sits a lot lower on the new Paul bag, which is one of the big things that they changed about the new bag. It's pretty difficult to get discs that are in the sides out of the old bag. And with this new lower main pocket flap, it's supposed to be a lot easier. Uh, the old grip bags just have the one large pocket on the side. These have, now have two individual pockets. Um, the top one for like a range finder, and then the bottom one definitely would fit uh, snacks or anything else. It's got kind of these elastic uh, stretchers here, and then it also has the expandable uh, the expandable side so it opens another I don't know it looks like two or three inches if you needed to expand the width of the side pocket let's see what else we have some velcro up here for patches that's new compared to the old bag I was using um, the side has a couple uh, couple things there again it has the one pocket here identical lower side pocket um, looking on the back this old bag had the umbrella holder which this one currently has but then on the other side it doesn't have what this new bag has and this is a retriever holder so if you carry a disc retriever you have a spot to hold that and then the padding uh, a little different compared to the old bag. The new bag has a channel here for ventilation. It's got double padding. The straps feel kind of the same as far as thickness and uh, the padding. And then there's a new mini holder up top here, which the old bag did not have. And then the water bottle holders can get looser or tighter depending on the size of drink you have in here and it'll hold it nice and snug and I think this bag came with a couple of extras in the top here we have some red grip uh, velcro patches we have a Paul Macbeth bag tag I think there's one more thing yep we have red zipper poles if you wanted to exchange the zipper poles and these are one finger zipper poles so you don't need to uh you know like this over here you'd have to use two fingers to move them but these are one finger zipper poles pretty cool let's see what it looks like putting the discs from my old bag into the new bag let's start with the putters up top they did tell me the new bag can hold one more putter than the old style so let's see i i have four that comfortably fit where i can get them in and out individually so right away the new bag fits four and then i like to carry my putting putter right here but let's see if the fifth one will fit up top here yeah that fits pretty well and once I play a few rounds with this bag it's gonna kind of shape to the discs uh, and they'll be easier to get in and out of from the top so right away we are holding more discs up top because I had to carry that fifth putter in the back flap there it's a little putter that I don't use too much so now let's look at the main compartment so as I was saying before like Getting discs out of the corners are pretty tough in the old bag. Like, I'm almost lifting my whole bag trying to get that one out. 
let's see how it compares to the new bag. I was told the main compartment can hold one more than the old. Let's see. So, we now have all the discs from the old into the new Macbeth bag, and it looks like it could potentially fit one more driver. Mid-range would be close. I have 21 that are going horizontal here. I have five in the top pocket and then my putting putter right here. So I'm carrying a total of 27 discs in the bag. Potentially has room for 28. I think it could fit a driver and it'd still be pretty comfortable. And then let's see if it's easier to get the side ones in and out. Definitely easier, they're still snug, but it's definitely easier than the old one. The discs in the main compartment that are in the center are so much easier to get in and out of. The, uh, the extra looks to be about an inch, inch and a half lower as far as the, uh, the height from here to the top. Definitely is making it easier to get the, the discs in and out. So that's awesome. I guess one thing I haven't looked at is the bottom. The bottom looks pretty identical. This actually has like a uh, weatherproof, waterproof material. This is kind of the same material as the rest of the bag. But sitting them up, let's see how the side pockets fit um, the accessories. So my old bag. What do I have in here? I really don't have anything other than a mini, which I guess the mini pocket, I have a big metal mini that fits right there. I don't know if I'll keep it there because I'm worried about losing it. It's so heavy. I feel like it might actually fall out, but if you have a lighter mini, it'd probably sit pretty sit snug there. I'll probably just keep the mini in a zipper pocket just to be a little safer. I don't want to lose it. But that's really all I carried. I do have my caddy bib in this pocket, so let's throw it in there. I have a towel in the additional water bottle pocket that I don't use. So let's throw that on that side. We can zip that up really easily. And moving over, looking at the water bottle holder on this one easily fits the uh, the big 32 ounce uh, bottle and then let's look at the other things I carry here so a couple snacks maybe we can make one of these pockets for snacks and towels I will put the range finder in this top one. They told me it was specifically designed for the Bushnell rangefinder. We have, let's see, hand warmer, hand warmer, and all the extra towels that are on the bottom. So let's throw those in. And that is it for that bag. We throw in the hand warmers. I don't know, maybe I'll make you gonna make this pocket the snack pocket. You gotta have a snack pocket. If you have a, a uh, like a chalk bag or something, I feel like that would be a really good option here. I don't use a chalk bag, so let's make that the snack bag. Ooh, I just saw the uh, pencil holder pocket right here. That's convenient. And everything from my old bag is now in this Macbeth bag. It zips up pretty simple and it looks great love the black look looks clean looks neat and I'm excited to use it this weekend at Austin okay everybody thank you for watching my breakdown of the new Paul Macbeth grip bag if you want leave a comment on the change you're most excited about in his new bag if you're thinking about getting one of these bags uh, I highly recommend it. I can't wait to use mine this weekend.
Hello, puppy. See you on the next video.